I'm Sharon Welchel filming here in Teston, California for my crochet studio for my Etsy shop Starlike. And today I'm going to be teaching you guys how to make a crocheted pillow. And we're going to make kind of a round decorative pillow. So to begin with, I chose a yarn that's a soft boucle yarn and it's really, I don't know, it's really nice to feel so it'll make a really great pillow. And it's a super bulky yarn so it'll work up pretty quickly. So to begin with, um, go ahead and chain three and then attach it with a slip stitch and then into that circle chain six or single crochet six and we're going to crochet in the round so there's no need to join it with a slip stitch. So then in each of those single crochets, you're going to single crochet two stitches. And basically what we're going to do is we're just going to make a flat spiral. So since we did two in each stitch, I'm going to do one in the next stitch and then two in the following stitch. And you kind of just do this by eye. So if you notice that it's starting to kind of scrunch up, then in your next row, just increase it a little more. And if it's starting to kind of ripple, like there's um, too many stitches, then just cut down on the amount that you're increasing. But in each row, you'll increase by a little less. So in the following row, we're going to do one stitch in the next two stitches and then two single crochets in the next one. And basically you're just going to repeat this until you reach the width of the pillow that you would like, or the circumference rather. And so I did it in two different colors. So you're going to make two of these. So I did it in two different colors. Um, one in white and one in gray. And what you're going to do is you're going to sew these pieces together and stuff it with um, whatever you choose. I usually use polyfill. So if you get your darning needle and then your yarn. And you can go ahead and start attaching the two pieces with a whip stitch. So just through the top loops of each piece. And I like to have kind of the swirl pattern facing out because it's a little nicer looking. And you'll basically just continue to whip stitch all the way around the pillow and just before it's closed, you'll want to stuff it with a polyfill. And that's how you make a crochet pillow. Mm -hmm.